light and our sun are hadith anticipating Laylat al-Qadr to fall on the 23rd or the 25th or the 27th. So in the beginning of this episode and after praising the Almighty Allah and sending the greatest peace and salutations upon his most beloved Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, I would like to remind myself and you brothers and sisters, my beloved viewers, with the importance of tonight and every night to come until the end of Ramadan, particularly tonight and um, the night of the 25th, the night of the 27th, and the night of the 29th. These are what we call them the nights which are Fardiyya or Witriya, yani odd in number. 23rd, 25th, 27th, and the 29th. Let's take advantage of every moment of these blessed nights. It simply could be Laylatul Qadr. And if it happens to be Laylatul Qadr, and you're up, and you're reading Quran, or you're praying, or reciting your azkar, or making istighfar, or sending the peace and the blessings upon Prophet Muhammad وسلم, or doing any form of worship, then lucky you. Allah has added another lifespan to yours. It is better than the worship, which is observed in 83 years and a few months continuously. May Allah enable all of us to witness the blessed night of Laylatul Qadr.